today's poem of the day on the 25th of August, The Splendour Falls on Castle Walls from The Princess by Alfred Lord Tennyson. This song-like poem by Tennyson seems to act out the wild echoes which it describes. The poet conjures up images of a beautiful realm in which the horns of Elfland echo across hills and lakes, growing louder forever. Unsurprisingly, given these horn calls in Tennyson's poem, the composer Benjamin Britten set this to music in his serenade for tenor horn and strings. The splendour falls on castle walls and snowy summits old in story. The long light shakes across the lakes and the wild cataract leaps in glory. Blow, bugle, blow, set the wild echoes flowing. Blow, bugle, answer, echoes dying, dying, dying. O oh, hark, O oh, hear, how thin and clear, and thinner, clearer, farther going. O oh, sweet and far from cliff and scar, the horns of Elfland faintly blowing. Blow, let us hear the purple glens replying. Blow, bugle, answer, echoes dying, dying, dying. O oh, love, they die in yon rich sky, they faint on hill or field or river. Our echoes roll from soul to soul and grow for ever and forever. Blow, bugle, blow, set the wild echoes flying, and answer, echoes, answer, dying, dying, dying.